This is a promotional video of the demonstration paper entitled Fedisquint, shopping online at a federated store using FedUp as Sparkle Federation Engine. Up to our knowledge, this is the first federated application based on web standard with such a large number of Sparkle endpoints, and this is of course the traditional use case of e-commerce websites. But a demonstration is worth more than a thousand words. First off, Unlike regular e-commerce websites, we can specify the federation of vendors that we want to include in our research. Let's choose, for instance, 20 endpoints, which means 10 vendors and 10 review endpoints. If we look for all products, we get 47,000 products coming from all 10 vendors. Now, as a regular e-commerce website, we can perform a regular keyword search. Let's look for Pyrenees. I instantly get a small range of products from different endpoints. By clicking on a product, I obtain detailed information about it. In addition, I get similar product and reviews about it. For each screen, multiple federated queries are performed, and in this demonstration, we can explore the log of operation and the endpoint chosen by the federation engine FedUp. For instance, when we look at the keyword search, we observe that all 20 endpoints were chosen but operations were grouped together to be sent on each endpoint for the sake of performance by pushing processing near the data. When we look at the query in charge of getting detailed information, we observe that all was done on one endpoint, which is that of the product vendor. When we look at the query to retrieve similar product, we observe that the federated queries are a lot more complicated than they look originally. Now, as previously mentioned, the user is able to specify the endpoints that compose its federation. Let's increase the number of endpoints to 100. Of course, the number of products increased drastically, comprising up to 287,000 products. Of course, performing the same query takes more time. And when we look into the log of operation again, we see that the same query became massive. And this is especially true for the query about similar products. But response times which are paramount for this kind of interactive use case, they stay reasonable thanks to the Federation Engine Fellow. More details about the demonstration are available in the paper to understand how it works. Furthermore, the code is open and available on the GitHub platform. Cheers!